Good morning. We have just had breakfast. We've left Taupo and we're on our way and we have decided to stop on the side of the road see our car parked. I did not want to stop. This is a place called Billy's Point. James is keen to have a jump in the summertime when you're traveling through the desert road and on your way to Taupo. Sometimes you just want a good place to stop and the lake is beautiful but this is a really neat spot to, I keep saying the word spot. How many times can I say the word spot in this video? It's a jump, it's like a, a platform that you jump off. He said, oh, who wants to go for a swim? None of us want to go for a swim. It's 11.30 in the morning and it's freezing in the water. It's a beautiful day and I said, if we stop, we'll watch you swim. Something's going on here and they don't want people swimming here. It might be because there's been poison. Oh no. Oh, yeah. Bully point, not Billy. What they're doing is a restriction of public access to places where workers are safe and undisturbed areas to operate. So they're doing something here. What are they doing? I don't understand. There's some work going on around here and they don't want people stopping and swimming. Oh. What are they going to do? Oh, like you can never capture like the beauty of places on a phone. I know. Like, can you can see why people jump off here though. Very clear water. Can I go down to this little ledge here, Dad? That's very clear. Please, please, put, do not fling those headphones around. Put them in your pocket. Put them in your pocket. Oh. Got my headphones. She's not there's always a way to climb up, like just down over here or further around. There's a couple of places you can climb up. Is this where people jump off there? Yeah. Beautiful, eh? Do you jump off this rock, do you reckon? No. Well, you just jump far enough out. And you yeah, if you can, do you reckon you could clear it from there? Yeah. You couldn't. That's nearly two metres out, Riggs. Dad, I would honestly jump off here. You would would you swim out to that boy, Em? No. What boy? There's a white boy out there. Yeah, nah. That's really far. Do you remember that time we started out to that pontoon way out in the distance? Yes. Well, I am really... It's the same thing. And the problem is you can't touch the ground at all. You kind of need kayaks to play around in here, eh? I know. But maybe there's something we don't see, Emma. Maybe that's why there's not many people parked here, you know? Like on a day like this, this be, should be packed. And it's not. Really? Yeah. So we're going to go in case we're breaking laws. We don't want to break laws today. I don't care. We're going to stop at this museum here in Mungaweka because we don't have the dog with us at the moment and when we come through again in the summertime and she'll be with us. Hey Regan and Emma, you want to come into the museum with us? No. Hey mum. Let's just go. Come on. Let's go. I'm James staying. and I are keen, eh? We're keen. Yeah. Yeah, that's a cool photo. I love old photos. What's a cool photo? That like, big, big one right there. Which was burnt down, so the school is now here. Yeah. You, you would have passed it as you went around. It's just old stuff from this, um, from this area. It's how the town would have really looked up. This is an old, the old railway station, and this is like a, replica of the old platform and this stuff here was drawn by a local artist that no longer lives here but um, she's done those drawings throughout the town. I love that, I love talking to... You enjoy that? Yeah. Hmm. Well, did you guys like that kind of? No. Not really. <laughs> I'm sorry but that looked extremely me, boring. That was it's so boring. But it's so fascinating if it's... If it's fascinating about it. <sighs> I liked talking to that lady. That's cool. She was nice. She had a very boring job. Do you know where to go to get this cafe? Yeah, she said you get up to the intersection. She was lovely and she's shown us a cool place to go to get some coffee down by the river. And I've never been down to the Rangitiki River, so. Down here? Yeah. Cool. So we'll go and check it out. And I've always wanted to come down and see what these white cliffs are about. She said that they're building a new bridge. Mm -hmm. It's an old bridge that works, but the new one's going to be completed in two years. I don't know if there's anywhere else to go other than down here. 
Bullock Cafe, campgrounds. On the river. Caution. Uh, 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 no, if there's a caution sign. No, right. it's just don't have you, not heavy traffic. Oh my goodness. Right. <gasps> I'm glad they're building a new one. They'd have it. They'd have it fenced off, Emma. He's got a break. Cafe, cafe open. <gasps> Campground office, cafe open. Did you know her? Yeah, that's Amy. She used to be in my film class last year. Oh, nice. Oh, look, they do rafting. Of course they do. Fun river trips. Guys, we're not doing anything like this today. I'm not in... Oh, so you're happy to go to a museum, but you're not happy to do fun stuff. <laughs> One hour splash and giggle. I think that's for toddlers. Can I get my coffee in a table? Oh, yeah. You can stop being tourists now. Right. No, I'm going to sit with this. Oh, gosh. Right. Yeah, we gotta do. What is it? Go talk to Lee. Oh goodness, it's beautiful. Look at this. You could have like a wedding here. I bet you people do. Looks like a walkway. Under the river. Looking, I can tell you're not looking where I'm looking. I'm looking at this bit right here. I don't think that's one of the You can run up to it. Slightly I steep, know. but still doable. I can whip it steep and slippery and freak out. Okay, so right now we're walking across the river and we've come to this beautiful cafe spot and it's got a lovely river everywhere and mum's up having a cup of coffee and we are following dad because that's just what we do so yeah honestly this is gorgeous i'm so happy we found this place so apparently there's a campground somewhere here Down there is the campground. Down by the river. Can you imagine the mosquitoes? No. So we're home and it's been a fairly relaxed afternoon. Unpacking, getting some washing on, picking up the dog who's happy to be home. Kids are kind of settled in and they're basically on holidays now. So James and I were just having some discussions about what we expect of them because, you know, they want to be on holiday and have some chill out. And James and I have still got two weeks worth of work, so we're just wanting to have some balance with them having leisurely holiday but still helping out a little bit. They're very, very good. They, they generally do anything we ask of them. Had yummy chicken burgers for dinner. Thank you, James. I kind of prepped it. But he cooked it. 
It was put all together in the incorrect order. Hey. <laughs> he did. He didn't have any salad ready and had cooked the burger buns. So they were going cold while we were making all the salad. It still turned out yummy though. It was real yummy. It was a nice. And I was watering all my plants and my vegetables and stuff while he was cooking dinner. So it's been a fairly relaxing afternoon. Ah. Come on, please. Our doggy likes to scare people. She's terrifying. She runs up and says hello to people and they don't like it. So tonight we are going to watch some episodes of Survivor. Yes. Yay. We watch it on demand, so we have to wait for it to come out, and we have been busy, so we're behind. That's exciting. It's better because if, if you watch it without having to watch it live, you don't get skip through ads. I know. Who wants to do with ads? My goodness. Anyway. It's another day of Vlogmas and I will see you tomorrow. Bye for now. Thanks for watching.